So by now, hopefully you have seen my what's in my bullet journal video. And even if you've only seen that in the other <laughs> bullet journal video that I did of the bullet journal supply haul, I will try to link those um, on this video. I figured I would do another bullet journal video for you guys. And what I am going to show you how to do is how to take a simple composition notebook. You can get these pretty cheap. I think I paid 50 cents for this one. Um, and honestly, it's just been sitting in a box waiting for me to figure out what to do. I'm going to show you how to turn a simple composition notebook into something that you can use for a bullet journal. So what I did here with this one is I took a composition notebook. I just covered the front of it with uh, some printed duct tape and then I divided all of the main pages up into uh, sections. I believe I grouped three or four pages together to create these sectioned pages. So there are about 25 page sections and I just cut, taped them together with some washi tape. So I'm going to show you what I did in this composition book, the only thing I've done so far is I put in some paper clips. I just went through, um, not on camera, and just grouped all of my uh, different sections that I wanted put together. So I grouped them by four because this composition notebook, I don't know if you can see right here, it says it has 100 sheets. So I made 25 little sections, but this is, you know, a cheap, easy way. I have this one already done and this is going to be what I'm going to use as a bullet journal. So now I'm going to go through and I'm just going to do some simple um, just page numbers in here and I think what I'm going to do is I'm not going to do the back side of every page so I'm going to take my favorite markers. I'm just going to take my Stadler ones and I'm going to pick out a I want to do. I'll use a green and I'll use a blue. So now I'm just going to go in and put in my page numbers and you guys will see as I do that now. So I just numbered them front and back. I decided to end up doing front and back. And now I'm just going to work on doing an index page. So for my index page, I just wrote index up at the top with a couple little hearts and then I numbered down the side to 25 and then I flipped this first page over and I numbered all the way down to number 50 because that is how many pages that I have in here. So I can just simply write on here. Um, I don't know how well I can do this one handily, which I'm just going to do it in pen and I'm just going to write that one and two is the index. And now my book is all set up and ready for me to go. And what I am actually going to be putting into um, this bullet journal is I have a stack of just old pen pal letters and notes and cards from when I was going through chemo and there's just different postcards and things. So I am going to be working on sorting this into a bullet journal and putting it all together. So that's what I'm going to be putting in this one. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next vlog. If you are not already and you would like to be, you can hit that subscribe button down below and thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye guys.